Well, despite that desperate effort to save it, dining at restaurants is now banned in L.A. County. That means hundreds of thousands of restaurants, restaurant workers in the state will be unemployed this holiday season. KCLINE's Candace Crone continues our team coverage tonight. She's live in Studio City with reaction. Candace. Yeah, the ban on outdoor dining affects, as you mentioned, hundreds of thousands of restaurants, including uh, Casa Vega here in Sherman Oaks. Now, business owners and city leaders fought the restrictions, but ultimately lost. Are you guys everything okay? I'm very frustrated and sad right now. Say goodbye to dining on the patio, on the sidewalk, or under a tent in LA County. As of 10 p.m. tonight, Restaurants and bars like Casa Vega and Sherman Oaks will have to offer to go only for at least the next three weeks. Bartender Gordy Zaragoza says this is a major setback. Definitely a downbreaking. Yeah, it's devastating. We were really starting getting our feet, and now we have to again figure out how to support our families. Despite passionate last minute pleas, the county has ordered all outdoor dining to halt, saying the surge is too high. Some restaurant groups and chambers of commerce vow to keep fighting to bring dining back. The owner of the Abbey icon, West Hollywood, today. Right now, the closure is for three weeks, but we know that it will extend through New Year's. And it will probably put me out of business. It was a similar scene in Long Beach where business owners were outraged, saying there's no scientific proof linking the spread of COVID-19 to outdoor dining. We have now formally requested and will be submitting a formal letter requesting that the Long Beach City Health Officer reverse her decision and the agency's decision to join the county in banning outdoor dining. People we spoke with say they fear the restrictions will cause the virus to spread and will lead to workers struggling to feed their families at a time like this. I'm frustrated because I think it's the complete wrong decision. I think that this is going to force people to go indoors and gather and see people, whether it's in groups of four or six. And I think that the, it will cause the virus to spike even more, which will keep us shut down even longer. Again, the outdoor dining ban takes effect for the next three weeks. There is a little bit of hope for restaurants in that they are able to offer takeout and delivery. We're live in Sherman Oaks tonight. Candace Crone, KCAL 9 News. All right.